I seen the video of what happened with the traveling girl and the black girl, I felt terrible. I felt the worst way in the world. I actually went to post the video about it and share my thoughts of how sad it was at what happened to the girl. But then I heard the backstory that this girl was abusing and bullying a disabled traveling child for a long time. And now, as many as you know, us travelers do stick together. We're reared up to stick together. That's how we roll. Yeah. But also, I was shocked, like, I was, I'm so upset that it couldn't have been sorted out in a different way, but it was sorted the way it was sorted, and that's it, we can't change the past. But now, the black community is doing videos and calling us the P word. Like, I was beaten up by a black man two years ago in central London. I'll show you the pictures in a minute. But that didn't mean to say that I'm going to pull up outside black people's houses and say, oh, we're taking back our turf, this is our land, and shouting racial slurs. Like, where does that get anyone? I don't understand, like, where does it get anyone? A grown ass man knocked me clean. A grown man knocked me clean work out, and then when I was on the ground, he kept kicking me. This was me arms from the kicks on him, and that was me fingers. Me fingers were broken. Just because that happened to me, I'm not going to go around discriminating every black person that I come in front of or make videos discriminating against people. Like that fella in that action man's outfit, he should be ashamed of himself. He's only doing nothing but just influencing more hate into the world. Like, it's just such, such bad negative vibes, and yeah, that's my opinion.